What's the best way to get clients with no experience? In this video here today, I'm gonna to be showing you how you can go and get your very first client, even if you have no experience and even if you've never coached anybody in your life. Hey, Lee Constantin here, the founder of Personal Trainers Elite, and we help coaches grow their fitness business online. And in this video here today, what I'm gonna be showing you is how to get clients without any experience, without having testimonials, and going and launching yourself into the market. Now, I know it's quite a daunting thought, right? Going and getting clients if you haven't even helped anybody in the past. I get that you're probably nervous and worried. Well, what if it doesn't work? What if they say no? And all these fears start creeping in. You start getting nervous because you, you're scared of getting rejected, right? Or, or, or worse, you're scared that you'll get the client and then you can't actually help them. So my very first tip when it comes to getting clients with no experience is become your best testimonial. So what I mean by that is go and actually embark on your own journey, your own fitness journey to go and get yourself into phenomenal shape, right? The best shape of your life, relatively speaking. Maybe you've already done that. Maybe you've already lost weight. Maybe you've already built muscle. Maybe you've already changed your body. Well, that right there is the best case study and testimonial you need to get yourself started. When I started fitness coaching, I didn't just become a fitness coach, I went through my own fitness journey. I was a fat kid and I was asthmatic. I got into fitness to overcome those insecurities and the way my body was looking. And that led me on to bodybuilding and winning national fitness titles and pro cards and becoming this, this fitness athlete from this, this fat dude. What that was, was the best testimonial I could ever have and need because that's all I needed to get started because when people see that you've gone on this journey, you've changed your body or you've achieved something significant within your health and fitness, people wanna know how you did it. And when people start asking how, that's that right there is your business opportunity. That, that means people are now interested in getting help from you. So become your testimony, your best testimonial, go and embark on your own fitness journey. And the best thing to do when you do this, and something I wish I'd done more of is document it. Document your journey. I actually did once document some of the journey to a competition, I think it was 2016 or 15 or 13 even, where I was competing and I blogged about it and it might still exist somewhere online. I don't know where it could be. Um, might even be on YouTube on some on a, on a channel of a brand I was working with. Check it out, GNC, should, should still be there, I don't know. But anyway, I documented that journey to share my results, share my journey. And although that didn't actually get me clients at that time, it built my confidence to go and get clients because through documenting that journey and sharing my my um, my experience, people became interested and people became curious and started checking me out and asking me questions online. So just by simply documenting and showing people the journey you're going through or you've been through is gonna get a lot of attention. So it's gonna build your confidence. Now the second thing that you can be doing to go and get clients with no experience is simply just offering your help for free. When you're starting out, don't have any shame in offering your help for free because there are people out there who would value somebody helping them and it removes the pressure from you to deliver this life-changing result if you haven't taken a, a cent from them, if you haven't taken any money. So that means there's, there's no loss to, to you or to them except a bit of time, but at least you're gonna figure out how to get this person results and you're gonna get more confidence to then go and charge that next person. And what you do, you take them on and you offer them this life-changing experience in exchange for a video testimonial and um, the ability to use their pictures uh, on your social media and on your advertising because that's going to become an asset that's going to help you get more people because when people see that you've you've gotten results for other people they're going to be more brought into you okay so it helps make the sale easier now you don't need them to get clients but it helps so offer your services for free to a couple people like literally two or three you don't need to help dozens of people for free because that, that's just going to burn you out and you're not going to enjoy it so just a couple of people to build your confidence if you're still a little bit nervous part of that actually what you can do is then also take on um, a few paid clients okay where you don't charge them the full amount because that kind of leads me on to the third thing which is actually launching like a, a beta group okay, a test group where you're saying hey i'm just looking to take on a few people to test out this new program that i'm going to be launching um, i'm going to be doing it at a ridiculous discount if you're interested, send me a message. Okay, so what you're doing there is you're seeding the idea of this new opportunity for them. They're gonna get access to you and this coaching program at a huge, ridiculously humongous discount, okay, whatever that price might be, just to value the time, okay, and just to value uh, for them to actually put the work in. 
And again, in exchange, you're going to get testimonials and proof of your program working. So, okay, so what, that's how you're going to get testimonials as well. Um, and so that's how you're going to be able to get clients with no experience. It's literally just about starting and offering it up. And I want to share this one last thing with you to help you overcome the imposter syndrome or the fear of getting started. If you've ever seen the movie Catch Me If You Can, um, if you haven't, it's a great movie with Leonardo DiCaprio. Go and watch it. Based on a true story, Frank Abagnale. And they asked him at the end of... of you know, his time when he got caught. Um, and just a quick backstory. He was a guy that went around America, posed as different professionals from pilots to university doctor professors and, and all sorts. And he was an 18 year old kid at the time. And they said, well, how did you pose as a, a college professor as an 18 year old who was younger than half these, these, these kids in college? And all he said to them was, I just read one chapter ahead. I was just one chapter ahead. So just think right now, all he did was read the next chapter to, to know that a little bit more than somebody else out there. So you don't need to be this, this super expert guru. You don't have to have years of experience. You don't have to have gone on dozens of courses. In fact, you don't have to have gone on any courses to really be able to help somebody. You just have to be able to help that person with that next step that they need to take. And if he can go and become a, a pilot and pretend to be a doctor, professor, I'm sure that right now you can be somebody that you are uh, that you you want to be but you're just not quite sure just yet and just overcome that imposter syndrome by realizing you don't need to know everything you just need to know a little bit more than somebody else which you probably already do which is why you're watching this video and you're curious and you're interested in how to take that step to get clients even if you don't have experience hope this video is helpful give it a thumbs up and hey leave a comment in the in the chat box below if you have any questions or if if you've tried to get clients with tests and you've not got testimonials or any case studies let me know and I'll be happy to kind of guide you in the right direction and subscribe to this channel for more training videos every single week. And if you want to find out more, there is a free training. I'll link it in the description of how to start and grow your fitness business online. My name is Eko Santanu and I'll see you in the next video.